Yo, what is up everybody? So I installed iOS 11.2.5 beta 6 on my iPhone SE and we're gonna take a super quick look at it. Man, I'm just laughing all over the place. But guys, before I even say anything further, I'm doing the Xbox One giveaway. So all you have to do, to, and it's my personal Xbox One. And in order to enter, all you have to do is subscribe to the channel and add me on all the social networks. All the links to my social networks are down in the description. So yeah, if you don't enter, I'm gonna be offended. But you know, I'll get over it in a couple days. But, but yeah, make sure you do that. But with this beta, Apple has literally done nothing in terms of, you know, features or anything like that. They say they're fixing the bugs, but I mean, I don't know what type of bugs they're fixing because it's still just as glitchy and weird as it was just like the day before before the beta and all this stuff so i don't really know what they're doing here in terms of the naming the 11.2.5 i doubt it's going to come out as 11.2.5 i'm pretty sure this is going to be 11.2.3 i don't see this being 11.3 i hope this is not 11.3 because they really haven't done much and i have been noticing on my iphone 7 plus my daily driver that i am getting my iMessages actually out of sync and I'm afraid to update on my daily driver because I just think there's going to be more bugs. And it's just weird that Apple had that happen. Like, it's the weirdest thing ever. Like, why did they do that? And I want to show you guys one more thing. Now, I might have to blur out some personal information, but when I click settings, right, do you see how that, like, as soon as I open it, like, I want you to look at it again. As soon as I open it, it literally opens the settings. Like, it's, like, upside down. As you can see, I have my rotation locked, and it's locked on this side. And I'll even show you guys. Like, here, I'll open up this internet browser whatever you see i'm here okay i'll go back up i'll lock it up so it's not like it's portrait or anything right it's like still here look when i open it it opens the settings like upside down so this is like what it thinks i, I like load it up as but it re i really don't and it's the weirdest thing ever like i don't understand how they even got that bug through there it's like the randomest thing ever it doesn't really affect any part of my phone or experience but it's just so weird that that was able to get through and like i said the iMessages out of order is another huge thing the performance has been okay with especially with this i should have ran a benchmark i kind of forgot to do it but expect really no difference in terms of speed or anything like that battery life pretty much just stay the same standby time everything i mean with these updates with these little betas i don't understand and i'm just curious on what they're fixing because all these problems are just like problems that people are already having and they're just fixing bugs where like nobody's even having the problems that I, I don't know what they're doing if you're on 11.2.1 or whatever i i would highly suggest for you to stay where you're at 11.2.2 or whatever do not update to the betas like i said they're pretty much pointless at this point i really wish i could say to update because i'm always happy to like have people update their phones and get a better experience but as of right now as of late you know there's really no big difference and i'm literally jealous of every single person who is on 11.1.2 or below because i really want to jailbreak and i want to jailbreak my phone i wish my daily driver was on 11.1 1.2 because there's so many more tweaks out and stuff for it i'm so jealous of every single person who's like posting videos about like how to do this how to do that on 11.1 1 .1 and i can't do it but whatever but guys that is pretty much it uh if you guys have any questions or anything like that leave it down in the comment section below i'll be happy to check it out make sure to leave a like though if you guys enjoyed the video but more importantly than everything else i love every single one of you guys and hopefully i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out till then